Hey, what's up, YouTube? We got Mr. P, the platypus, and her Yushanka hat. You want to put that Yushanka down real quick so we can kind of see? I mean, she's got tied up for, I mean, because the, the snaps that came with it made it incredibly too short. Long. Or long, yeah, like, it, it looked funny. It didn't hold up tight, so. Basically, get a side view of that. Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. Perry it's the Perry the platypus. All right, guys. As you can see, Liz is in a freaking shirt. All right, and it's December. It's just, it's 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 the middle of December. And uh, in the last video we did, the chopping video, messy. Got a mess to clean up. But as you can see, nonetheless, is it's starting to kind of thaw out. It's 40 degrees out here. Man, that's like, it feels like 60. I'm not even joking. I don't know if I have a coat on even. But, uh, you know, Liz's not wearing her coat. But, uh, Liz, what do you got for us today? I wanted to show you my kukri. I showed it in the... Your kukri? Not kukri. We were just talking about kukri. My, um, kunai, we were talking about it. I showed it in the last video of me doing a one and a half spin bank shot. And I redid the paint job. It's just spray paint like his kukri but I'm really trying hard. I have a set of three, and so far I've only got half of one done, but it looks really, really good, and I'm really excited to finish the whole set. Yeah, see, this is why, uh, see, we, we, there's this art show that happens every year, and I always tell Liz, I said, if you could actually complete something, we'll put you in the art show to make some money. Well, the year goes by, I asked her if she's completed anything, and she says no. So you task that hand, not her strongest quality, but when she does complete something, it normally looks pretty good. So, so anyway. Jeff did the paric or Oz did the paracord wrapping previously and we taped it all off and then we put down the white coat and we did two coats of that and then did the light pink digital. No, we said we're not guys. The light pink digital on that thing. And then the dark pink cross. I also you can't hardly see it, but there's a light pink ring around the outside of this part of the handle and then the back side isn't isn't done yet like i said guys with her procrastination it's issues not procrastination it's, it's just problems completing tasks but anyway that is one side done so that's what all three will look like yeah. and all three they are going to have them all done on both sides are you going to leave one side completely done and one side white i haven't decided yet just because it does take so much time i might do just one side but then again I might do both I don't know yet it's kind of hard to do things with a baby so but I think it would look okay even if there was just one side done yeah I think I think you're right on that uh basically guys um she's she, she likes to get into the whole she's starting to get into the whole uh the whole graphics on on knives stuff like that so, uh, show her full support. Uh, she tried really hard on that cross. If you can imagine trying to cut out on a piece of paper to yeah, lay a did, stencil. Uh, actually, it's cartons from, uh, cigarette cartons that we tore down from work. And we cut stencils out of them with a razor blade and then taped them down, spray painted it, waited for it to dry, pulled it off, taped down another one. So, it, I mean, just doing, like... The two layers of white was like an hour, two hour process. It takes a while. But it's definitely worth it in the end. And I also did my everyday carry knife, which I will show you in another video. You don't have it on you? <laughs> it's in the house. <laughs> okay, so basically you got an everyday carry knife that you're I, not carrying. I didn't leave the house yet. Hmm. Sounds like also procrastinating what to carry. <laughs> uh, basically, guys give her full support on this uh she worked very hard on this design uh as you notice you know anything paint takes time and it takes a lot of just effort um well like i said it's, it's just it's it's stalling too quick to go out ice fishing uh there was only on some of the lakes we we checked out there's only maybe a good three three inches of ice anyway and uh i don't really want to fall through the ice and liz is this is her first time ice fishing uh, so I'm, I'm trying to like make sure that the ice is safe as possible for for her sake and uh, try to give her the best experience she could possibly get 
Um, part two of that video, I was talking about kukri. Guys, I don't know when it's going to be done. I have to, uh, I have to, uh, go to the woods and actually do a tree cutting video. And since my mom lives in a lovely trailer park, as you guys have seen the trailers around, I just exactly, I can't, I can't cut down a tree in here. They, uh, they, they frown upon that extremely high. So, uh, Basically, we covered we covered chopping, we covered splitting, and I know, guys, that was not a huge log I split it, okay? But it could it could put up the task. You could you could baton that thing through something bigger. Uh, anyway, I'll go through batoning with it. I will also go down through feather sticks again with actual good wood this time, and. Uh, that's that's basically why I carry a machete rather than an axe. Uh, I just prefer the machete over the axe any day. It's more of a multi-tool, and I love multi-tools. I love a tool that can complete different options for a survival situation. Also, I wanted to bring up, we are going to do three Altoid 10 container, or survival kits, all right? We're doing a small Altoid. We're going to do two large Altoids. The one Altoid we're doing is going to be for uh, urban survival, the other for woodland survival, and the third one, the small one, that's going to be Liz's to create something, I don't know how, how, how you girls can fit so much stuff in such a little spot, so I'm going to give that task to her to complete. Um, I think Liz wants to show her kunai one more time, mm -hmm. so it's coming up in the screen here now. Down, down. Looks like a shield. Yeah, that kinda, was my idea. Yeah, her, yeah, it looks kind of like a shield, like a night shield. Um, yeah, it, like I said, it's it's warm out here. Uh, so anyway, Oz and Liz are out. We will see you in the next video. Remember, guys, be safe <laughs> on all the stuff you do. Be safe for Christmas and you're during your travels. Um, and if you're never prepared for any situation, well. You probably won't make it out alive. Oz out. Bye.